Everyone, this is Mr. Clown Zero One. Today we're looking at the Star Wars Muppet figure set of Fozzie Bear as Chewbacca and Link Harkthrob as Han Solo. Let's take a quick look at the package. Nice picture of the two of them behind the Millennium Falcon. Custom artwork on this. Has it is on all the ones from this. Nice open sides like I've shown you before. So you can see the whole thing. Back is custom again. Again, it's $20 for the two figures or $19.95 to be precise. Open on all sides, you can see the figures really well. So let's open it up and take a look at them. We have Fozzie Bear as Chewbacca. He has swivel at the hip. This, I cannot get this one to move, I don't want to try it too hard. For fear of breaking, it could be because the uh, bandolier uh, satchel down here interferes. I think that's what it is. And arm, his swivel shoulder, and cut elbow. He does not have the wrist swivel, as a lot of them do in this series. And of course, the head turns. He does not have any articulation at his waist. He also has a little trouble standing. I think that's because, like I say, I can't get this quite right. I don't know if it'll show, but there's a little gap there. Let's see if I can zoom in. You can see, maybe it'll show up. There's a little gap in here. I think that's why. I don't think the leg was put on quite right. But, that's okay. Let's give you a quick 360 of Fozzie. And he comes with his weapon right here. So let's see how he holds it. And I'm going to probably put it in his left hand because I think there's too much busy over here to put it there. But I, I really do like, I do like the rubber chicken there. That's a really cool detail. Let's see if he can hold it very well. Uh, nope, not that hand. Let's try this one. Let's see what I can do. few minutes of messing with it. I finally got it in his hand. It's very tight. Uh, it doesn't really hold it that well, but I still like him. I also was able to get this leg to swivel out, so he stands much better than he did earlier. So there we have Fozzie Bear as Chewbacca. We have Link Hark Hog Throb as Han Solo. I have to admit, I'm not familiar with this character. Is um, leave a comment in the show notes on this. I think he's the one who used to be on Pigs in Space on the TV show. But I'm not 100% sure. But let's look at the figure. No leg articulation at all. Okay. He does have waist. He's also got a nice kind of attachment of the uh, holster here. Arm swivel at the shoulder. Cut joint at the wrist and of course I'm sorry cut joint at the elbow of swivel joint at the wrist huh. and his head swivels also the vest removes so it's kind of a nice thing if you want to display him a little differently and he comes with one accessory and that is the blaster which you can fairly he held it fair he holds it fairly well it's good and tight So we can pose them with that. Put that back up there. Let's give you a quick 360 of him holding that. I mean, look at the detail they did on the back of the vest. So there we have a Link Hog, hog Throb, excuse me, as Han Solo the two figures together and I'll show you some scale comparisons once again. Let's begin with Jedi Mickey or Luke Skywalker Mickey more properly. My R2-D2. And we'll go ahead and put in the Tron Vinylmation. So as you can see these are very large figures but they are so nice. So this concludes our look at Chewbacca. Or excuse me, has uh, this concludes our look at Fozzie as Chewbacca and Link Hog Throb as Han Solo. 
Uh, leave a comment in the show notes. Let me know what you think about these figures. And as always, have a great day.